When you're in Huntington Beach, California, you can find plenty of places to eat with you and your dog, but you are not going to find any place like the Park Bench Cafe. It takes pet friendly to a whole nother level. Right, Pete? So the pack and I maneuvered our way through the crowd, grabbed a table, and ordered for everyone. From the canine cuisine, we're gonna get one hot diggity dog, one bow wow wow, one rover easy, he agrees. About 93, we kind of uh, realized that we were having a lot of people bring their dogs here. You know, we just added items just based on people's requests over the years. Hamburger and fries, he liked that. I think he liked a hot dog better. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> And if you do a little sniffing around like Pinta, you'll find that these people and their dogs wouldn't want to be anyplace else. Because there's not enough places to take your dogs and have a good meal. We did go out of our way, but it's all about woo. But that's, you know, any opportunity that I get so that we can have a good time and he can have a good time with us, then, you know, we go for it because he's part of the family. Now, you said you've been here before, right? Yes, I've been here uh, probably like three, four times. Cosmo's had dates here before with, with other dogs. <laughs> and while the atmosphere is awesome and Huntington Central Park makes the setting spectacular, ducks. Ducks, does Pinta see the ducks? Better keep her away. Pinta sees nothing but ducks. Ooh. Come on. It's really all about the food. Hot dog. It's good. It's just chicken. Bow, wow, wow. I think that it's important that people do socialize their dogs. So a venue like this is just perfect because it gets them out with one another and, and it makes for a better dog. I think it makes for better people as well. Oh, absolutely. It's nice to have a dog community be amongst other dog lovers. Munyako, give it up, man. And it's especially nice when it's good to the last drop.